All right, and we're back. Let's go into these ruins. Oh, I didn't want to do that. I actually wanted his powers. Oh, well. Um, yeah, in the in the in-between episodes, we were talking in the chat. I'm very happy with um, my little stuffed stuffed creatures up here in the background. The, the eventual goal, I think, is to have that entire curtain covered in uh, plushes. Little plush creatures. Yeah, this music was cool. It feels kind of grand. Um, oh, I wanted the fire guy. Dang it. 90% <laughs> of this playthrough is going to be me saying, oh no. I wanted that thing, whatever that thing was that I just accidentally killed. Yeah, so if anyone has any ideas, or how do I get there? On what, um... I, I like that Kirby's breath is enough to kill. Oh, that's not what I wanted at all. Um, because currently, what do I have back there? I have a Meta Knight, Sonic, Iron Man, Captain America, Kirby, Tanuki Mario, um, and an Adipose from from Doctor Who. I miss anybody? Oh, and a Yoshi. And a University of East uh, Anglia bunny. So anyone has any ideas what else I should put up there, let me know. I think I have an Appa from Avatar The Last Airbender on the way. Past that, I don't have any uh, plans for what to put put up back there. Dang it. I'd like to get maybe... I need to get a Tails. Because what? Sonic needs a friend up there. I was trying to find if they had any... Um, I want a Wind Waker link to put, put back there. But I hate the design of how most of the plushy uh, manufacturers have made Windmaker Link. It looks kind of uh, dopey. Okay, I need to solve this right now. Is water a power set? No. Well, at least the fish doesn't give it if it is. Hmm. Fishy. We oh, I think he's boomerang. Yeah, uh, two away from a one up. Boomerang plus boomerang is just giant boomerang. So what is boomerang plus spike? All right, let's do it this way. What is boomerang plus spike? All oh, right, I knew that. It was it's Chompy Boy. Huh. One up, please. Yay. Okay, I don't like that. I'm going to I'm going to get Spike Man now. Or not. Dang it. <laughs> I knew that was going to happen, too. I thought I could time it better. Boing. Boing. Back with my grapes and, and jamas. Aw, oh, that sounds lovely. I should be wearing pajamas, but 
I turn off the air in the house. It's been stupid hot recently. Today got up to 100, 304, I believe. Um, but I turn off the air because otherwise the air, my air vent runs right across up here and it blows straight into the microphone, which isn't good for anybody. I think I need to trust this one. Yeah. Go, 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 go. Okay. So I think boomerang and fires my next combo I want to try. I want that job. Not the job of the programmer or um, the concept artist or whoever. But I want to be the guy in the room that goes... Aha! Oh, dang it. That comes up with these combinations. Dang it. I keep deathing. Okay, I want spike and I want electricity. Or does it just make me an electro spike man? Have I already tried this? <laughs> so it's like 10 minutes ago that I tried this. I like how the spike, when you when you impale someone, it stops them for a second. Oh no, spike and fire is what I want to try. Aha, oh. Well, you're gonna get digested. How's that feel, Mr. Fireball? Okay, fire and electricity, let's do it. <laughs> Someday I'll learn how to aim this curvy thing. And it better be soon, because I think I might be close. Actually, I won't say anything. I don't actually know where I am in the game. Hey, Cozy, hi. Hi, Jay, how are you? DD with his hammers and his... It's cute, it's all... What are the combos? I forgot the combos. Oh, I, I totally... See, ah, I went to the gas station. And I remembered, there was something I needed for the Kirby playthrough. But for the life of me, I could not remember what I was supposed to grab. It was the combos. Dang it. Um, so next Tuesday, I will remember the combos. <laughs> I felt dumb too. I was literally standing in the gas station. Guy, you know, the guy was looking at me because I was just standing there trying to remember what I was supposed to get. And I, I couldn't, you know, ask him. Like a... Man, it was for my live stream. Dang it. You know, actually, after this playthrough, they have cracker combos and pretzel combos. Which, which one do you recommend? I've never had combos before. What Which combos do the chat recommend I get? I, I'm leaning towards... Um, how do I get up there? Oh, I'll just go around and grab that then while I see it. I'd be leaning towards um, both make your mouth dry. Well, yeah, looking at what a combo is, I don't, I don't doubt that. Uh, I'm going to go probably with cracker combos. What's for Thursday? Uh, more Hulk. Gonna keep on, keep on keeping on with the Hulk game. I'm having a lot of fun with that. Especially as I'm getting more uh, combos and stuff. Or not combos, but you know, abilities unlocked. He feels more and more OP. Ah, oh, dang it. You have to get the jump perfect, I guess. Yeah, Hulk will be played. I don't think I have too much further to go in that game either. Dang it. <laughs> How many times have we gone watch me fail at this jump? Um, I feel like I'm a pretty good distance through Hulk. Then I'll figure out what the next Thursday game is. I got a couple ideas for what it might be. 
But I'm not going to say anything about that until I get further through Hulk, because my um, idea might change depending on when in time that happens. It's going to be something completely different, though. I can guarantee that. How do I get out of here? It's a me. Oh, I gotta go up and then right and then. Yeah. But where does that go? That's how I get out. Cool. These levels are so short. Boing. Oh. <laughs> Sad Kirby. All right. Let's go, let's go. See, I remember all these levels. I just don't remember what order they come in. Oh, it's letting me go this way. Cake. Do you think Kirby even cares about cake at this point? All the stuff he's consumed over the years. And then depending on how long uh, Kirby lasts. Oh, here's my chance. Aha, dang it. <laughs> okay, what's fire and fire? Let's learn what that is. Double fire. Whoa. Okay. Do I get through here? Or how do I get that crystal? Uh, how do I get that crystal is also uh, one of the catchphrases for uh, Florida man. Oh, how do I get down there? I need to somehow... Break through this. Or get under it, maybe? No, I need to break through it. Maybe if I shoot myself from here? No. I need something like physically smashy. Hmm. I was looking at my work schedule. They're paying me in box office soon, and I'm so worried. Uh, you work at the theater, right? If I remember correctly. What what's what's scary about box office? I wouldn't think box office would be too scary at a theater. All you do is uh, unless you're afraid you're gonna gonna mess up. Like payment information or something. Customers. Yeah, fair point. Customers aren't fun. I. And and all the time I've worked in restaurants and stuff, the goal was always to get. Oh, I gotta go back out. That's how I get to the crystal. Crystals in this other one. Also, I have no idea what I'm doing there. And you'll figure it out. Oh, this isn't right either. I need to go back out. Dang it. I'm gonna have to start IDing people. IDs are pretty easy. Um, I was like, can I get out of here and go get that other crystal? Still? Or am I locked in? Well, I guess I'm not getting that crystal. Um, oh, never mind. That's how you get to it. Cool. At least at the, um, when I had to ID people at the comedy club, uh, they had a booklet of all the different state IDs and how to identify them. And as long as you learn, actually the hardest part for me, I don't know if this would be an issue for you, is remembering the math. Because I assume the only IDing you're going to have to do is if someone's 18 or not, for, or is it 17, for rated R stuff. So you're just going to have to remember what year 
people turn, I want to say it's 17. So that'd be what, 2004? So people born in 2004 are now 17? There's a reference for ages. Oh yeah, they're gonna have the, uh, probably a little thing you can look and go. If you were born, if they were born before this date, they cannot see. Like the like the little things you see in gas stations for uh, tobacco purchasing. Does it pay more? Box office versus what you were doing before. I hope it does. Any job where you have to deal with people. We had problems with kids sneaking into theaters. Yeah, but that's kind of the fun of it, right? That's... You, you had to have at least try to sneak into a radar movie at some point when you're underage. All pays the same aim position, but I did get a raise. Well, congratulations on the raise. Um, and I'll say this. Don't let bad customers get you down. Some people just want to have to vent their frustration. And unfortunately, you're the guy with no power that they're venting it at. Um, when I was in... God, I, I could... I was maybe... Just turned 16. Would... No, it would have been whatever year the first Hunger Games movie came out. So I may not have been, even been 16 yet. But we tried to sneak into the last American Pie movie. What am I going for? What am I going for? Uh, let's go for the red thing over there. Or nothing. Nothing's cool too. So, and it was a little, like, ma, mom and pop movie theater. Like, just the local movie theater. It wasn't a chain or anything. But the problem was that the theater was only um, five screens. Three on one side, two on the other. So, our cover movie for American Pie was... Um... Hunger Games. Little did we know that Hunger Games was on the exact opposite side that we needed to be on for American Pie. But I think American Pie started 15 minutes later than Hunger Games. So we got in our Hunger Games, sat down, just three of us, three guys, three high school guys, going to see Hunger Hunger Games. Um, and we try to sneak over to the other side of the theater. Which was unsuccessful because you have to go completely by the lobby and by all the employees to sneak around. We, we go to sit down in... Ooh, Crystal. I need the health though, so I'll take Sandwich Route. And we got caught... So quickly. We were in American Pie for maybe three minutes. And they came in, the guy goes, You guys you guys gotta get out. Which me and my friend, um I'm gonna call him Frosty. We're, we're fine about it. You know, we got caught. We weren't supposed to be there. Look, I'm studying the art. It's cute. Um, is this a puzzle? Maybe. I don't know. But, you know, we got caught. Whatever. All's fair. But my, but my other friend, let's call him... Ooh. 
Let's call him Davy, because I think he's in the Navy. Davy was mad. He's like, you can't kick us out. We paid for our ticket. You gotta, you gotta give us a refund. And I'm like, and we're like, uh, no, we, we tried to underage sneak into a raid our movie. You don't get a refund. We had teenagers cause a disturbance, and the cops came. Please tell that story. Also, what movie were the teenagers? I'm assuming by teenagers you mean someone was underage trying to get into theater. So what movie were they trying to sneak into as well? That seems like crucial information. Ammo, please. Boop. Uh, what movie did I just see? I just saw A Quiet... Oh, this is going to date the episode a little. But I just saw A, a Quiet Place 2 last night. And it was wonderful. I really enjoyed the first movie. And the second one just continued to build up onto it. Which I love when a sequel can do that. Have a logical um, build off the first movie. Bang. More ammo, please. There we go. And boop. I gotta time that better. So there you fire. And boom. Dang it. I still want to see... Cruella? Though at this point I might just wait until that comes on to Disney Plus for free. And I want to see Spiral. Because that movie's fascinating to me. Ah, electric. I got these little, uh... Stripper pole situations. Cause enemies to appear. And try to attack Kirby. There we go. Oh, not an automatic platform. Um, let's go for the trading card. Ha! Yeah. Got it. Next episode. Or not episode, jeez, it's not, I'm not even close to time for next episode. See, this is when the game really punishes you for not having grabbed any powers during the level. Oh, I remember this. Okay, you just have to... Nintendo is getting funky with their 3D here. Oh, I really gotta focus on this. No chat reading. Until... Until I survive this laser... This, um... Planetarium laser light show. Oh, I wanna go to a planetarium laser light show. Maybe now that the world is opening up again, I can do that. I loved going to the Pink Floyd laser light show in college. They did, uh, Dark Side of the Moon. I did it my freshman year. Oh, now I gotta fight them? How does that work? Oh, okay. Is red only good against red or does it work against all colors? No, all colors work against all. Okay, good. Uh, but I did the Pink Floyd laser light show my freshman year, like very near the beginning of my freshman year. And then literally on my last day of college, I did the, I don't think that did any extra damage. So I don't think color matching does anything. Mine, green. Ah, uh, mostly because I like narrative, uh, trying to make life 
narratively sound like that. Oh. Uh. Oh, actually, can I? Aha. Oh, dang it. Oh, they're dropping bombs, man. Why is this so much more difficult, dang it, than I remember it being? I have to start all the way over? Okay. At this point, I wonder if it's worth it to go back a level, grab some power-ups, and then try this boss fight fresh using those power-ups. And probably not. I mean, the game sh is made easy enough to where you shouldn't have to plan too far ahead like that. All right, then we got this one where it's easy if you just follow in limbo or uh, sh strafe them. Ah. I want as much health as I can get going into this part. as many hits him as possible. Oh, right, right, right. Now if I shoot at him again, is he... Yeah, it just goes around. So I think you want to take him out one by one because now I don't think Red can attack me. Yeah, cool, cool, cool. Yeah, that's exactly what I want to do. Oh, well, I don't want to do that. Dang it. All right. Huh. I, you know, this song will randomly pop in my head and I never remembered what it was from. Kirby 64. Dang it. Okay, I can't take another hit. Ah! I'm going to call that episode there. I stream every Tuesday, Thursday here on the YouTube channel and over at Twitch at Cozy Blanket Gaming. And next episode, I will both read the story on why this guy had to call the cops on teenagers at the movie theater, and I will beat this boss battle. So I will see you in the future. Won't you please subscribe?